George Russell one of four drivers to message Nikita Mazepin after Haas sacking. Fired Formula One driver Nikita Mazepin revealed he has received messages of support from drivers including Mercedes newcomer George Russell after the Russian was dropped by Haas. The 23-year-old said he found out he had been dismissed in a press release and has not ruled out taking legal action against the American-owned team. Dmitry Mazepin is an oligarch close to Russian President Vladimir Putin and he even attended a one-to-one -one meeting with the president on the same day the 69-year-old launched the attack on Ukraine. Dmitry is owner and chairman of Russian fertilizer company Uralcom, whose brand Uralkily served as the central sponsor of the American-owned Haas outfit from 2021 until recently. Once the Russian invasion of Ukraine began, Haas removed their Aralkali branding, and placed the future of driver Mazepin into doubt. On Wednesday, Aralkali published a statement demanding immediate reimbursement of money already transferred to Haas for the forthcoming season. The fear had allowed Russian drivers to continue under a neutral flag following the country's widely condemned invasion of Ukraine. However, the sport's governing body also insisted all drivers must agree to its principles of peace and neutrality and acknowledge the strong commitment made by the fear to stand in solidarity with the people of Ukraine and all of those suffering as a result of the ongoing conflict. Mazepin said he did not consider signing the document as he was let go by Haas the following day, and he has revealed the names of drivers who have lent their support since the news. I appreciated the small number of drivers who expressed their support for me, said Mazepin, speaking from Moscow. Sergio, Perez, Valtteri, Botos, Charles, Leclerc, and George, Russell, all contacted me. They know how important the situation is, and they showed their support after I lost the opportunity to compete. The messages were nothing political but just on a personal level, to keep my head up because athletes have been broken and lives have been destroyed after a decision like that. Mazepin was asked on three occasions whether he felt it was was realistic he could continue in F1 given his father's links to Putin. He replied calmly, insisting he was willing to race under a neutral flag before adding he will offer legal aid to Russian athletes who have been essentially abandoned by their sport as sanctions take their toll. Mazepin added that Haas have not contacted him since the press release, a method of relaying the news he disagrees with. The 23-year-old is particularly disappointed at the situation given it was his dream to compete in F1. I lost my dream which I have been working towards for 18 years, Mazepin concluded. I didn't imagine the situation of losing my drive would happen so soon. But I absolutely do not see Formula One as a closed chapter. I am going to stay in race condition and I will be ready to take on an opportunity if it comes. The 22 race 2022 campaign, which was set to be a record 23 races before the Russian Grand Prix was cancelled, begins with the Bahrain Grand Prix on March 20th.